I remember actually the first drawing that I ever did that I was proud of was probably in first or second grade. But I remember drawing this monster with these, these big giant tusks coming out of his face. I realized that that was mine. I made that, like that came out of my head. And the idea that I could keep going with that and I could recreate it or add to it, it's, it's that sense of imagination as a kid that just kind of keeps rolling and rolling and rolling and I, I really like that. My name is Toby Putnam, I'm an independent artist and my brand is Whiskey Mouth. The city was just never a fit for me. Um, I wanted out of there from the minute I moved there. Uh, now that I'm in Oregon, I've kind of started over and it's, it's working out. It's like I'm really starting to create a lot more work and everything seems cohesive now. Right now I'm living in this Kwanzaa hut on uh, five acres of farmland. It's quiet out here. It's the perfect energy to create and just have a quiet mind. I think that's what I didn't have when I was in the city. I've been using a lot of uh, a lot of reclaimed materials lately, and uh, I've been finding a lot of barn wood and and just scrap scrap lumber that I've found and charred and and uh, I like the the idea that it's been out in nature and like exposed the elements. If I had to describe my style, I'd probably say that it's free flowing, organic. I used to be quite the perfectionist within my work, and I've been able to just allow the work to actually evolve now. And I think that that's something that uh, a lot of artists have a hard time with, is just allowing it to be what it's going to be. Um, I started working in pen and ink recently, and it leaves very little room for error because you do make a lot of mistakes, and it can't be perfect. A lot of things that I've created um, are very flawed, and I like that. I like looking at them and I like remembering the actual process when I made that mistake and how it happened and what I was thinking during the process. Mm -hmm.